Corey Revely from Keller Williams, your local realtor, and I'm here with Jay, the owner of Superior Lakes Mead Wine and Cellar. Um, our intent is to highlight some of the local businesses, and he's located here on Jefferson, right by Wilson Marine. So this is our owner, Jay, and we're here to ask him a few questions. So the first question is, how did you get started? You know, ages and I ago, ages and I ago. Ages ago. Ages ago. <laughs> Aaron and I. Aaron, yeah, you. you want to tell the story? <laughs> sure, why not? Uh, ages ago, uh, Aaron and I, we go to the Renaissance Festival when we were younger. Uh, and then as we, we became you know, old, old, old enough to drink, we would always have meat there. But meat wasn't really in stores anymore. So it was kind of like a once a year type thing. And I happened to find a recipe for it one day. It kind of as a joke. I showed it to him. And he's like, yeah, he's going over the ingredients list. He's like, yeah, we can do this. Nothing is too hard to find. Like, but we don't know the first thing about this. And he's kind of, well, we do a lot of things that we don't know the first thing about, so let's give it a shot. And, uh, and we did, and it was a lot of fun, and he was taking a lot of notes, and I was kind of being a nuisance mostly. Um, <laughs> I got pretty good at making wine, he got really, really good at making wine. And, uh, and, and here we are, about 15 or so years later. So how long has this building been in business? Uh, You've been in, in business in this building? In this building, we've been here for three years. Uh, I think it's like, it might be like three years to the day almost. Um, and we were two, five years, uh, two doors down. Okay, and um, what are your hours? Uh, we're open Thursday through Sunday here. Uh, Thursday is two to eight. Uh, Friday and Saturday are noon to eight, and Sunday is noon to six. The easy way to remember it is we're open Thursday through Sunday, noon to eight every day, except we show up two hours late on Thursday and we cut out two hours early on, on, on Sunday. <laughs> I love this. And um, right now, um, how many front lines do you have on tap? Right now, I think we have 19. Uh, we generally have at least 15. We try not to go two more than that, or too much higher than that. Uh, we have our, our, our year-round list. Basically, everything at the top of the board there is year-round. Some things are blacked out. We try to do year-round. We don't. We try to. Our limited releases are seasonal. And then our open data is things like definitely not a muffin, uh, Burns, Oars, and Taki Lime Cider. A lot of them are just, uh, just you know, exercises and creativity kind of things. That we'll just do a real small batch, and when it's gone, it's gone. If the reception's really, really good, it'll come back. Um, and it's just, we're just kind of messing around. The air just going wild, being a mad scientist back there. Awesome. So where do you get all your raw materials from? Uh, a lot of the grapes come from either California or Chile. Um, most of the honey is in-state. We get the honey for our white bean, which took the gold medal, the 15 gold vegetable from Traverse City area. Um, the blueberries come from South Haven. Um, pears out that way as well. You know, we, we try to support our local farmers the best that we can. We do have to chase quality and we chase price. You know? um, even our labels. Our labels are made over in uh, uh, Wixom. We try to you know, get everything as close to the local as we can. Awesome. And what big events do you have coming up? Well, we have our Halloween party coming up on the 27th. It's a Saturday. We're going to have exclusive drinks. We'll have a costume party with prizes. Um, all sorts of, sort of fun for the holidays. We try to do a little holiday thing, you know, for, as, as the months go by. Awesome. Yeah. I was so glad to be able to interview oh, you. Oh, absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank you. So this is Jay from Superior Lake Mead Wine and Cider here in Harrison Township. And again, here's one of our local businesses. Come and see Jay and come by for his Halloween event on the 27th. See y'all soon.